Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to be talking about a far superior med to your standard load resistor. For the people who don't know what a load resistor is, or don't have to deal with them if they have a newer truck, load resistors are more popular in the older body trucks. A load resistor basically, basically equals out the load on your blinker bulbs, so it doesn't send too much of a signal to one, so it flashes too quick and it results in hyper flash. So, Let's just start off with the cons of a load resistor. Not only do you have to wire, wire them in, you have to pull your headlight housings out, wire your load resistor in, you got to check all your connections, make sure you have good connections because no matter what you do, your wires will still jingle around. And then you have to find a place to mount them, to 3M them, or screw them in. Uh, I would go with screwing in if I was to get a load resistor. But I particularly did not like them. And for an OBS Chevy, they're actually more expensive than this little booger right here. Which most of you, as soon as you saw this, if you do on an OBS, you probably already know what this is. This is a heavy duty or electronic flasher. The names correspond. They're the same exact thing. I ordered this one as a heavy duty and I got it and it was an electronic so they are the exact same thing. And what this does is the same thing as the load resistor. It also fixes your hyper flash. It just does it in a much simpler fashion. And by much simpler, I mean just that. Instead of having to wire everything in, go down here. And I probably won't be able to get to it with the camera. Maybe I can. You plug that in and your hyper flash is automatically fixed and that's all it takes you have LEDs I am running as many of you know you may not know I do run switchbacks but you're gonna need a load resistor with any kind of LED blinker bulb I found this after watching a couple videos either by bad Z71 or trucks and water maybe both but if you follow me then there's a Great possibility to possibly follow them as they are the two best OBS YouTubers there is. And I found this, and we can talk about price for a minute. So, Chevys, older Chevys, decided to just go hella blinkers. You can see here. So, I got four blinker bulbs total and a pair of load resistors that being a set of two is actually twenty dollars if you get some that are chinese made but will actually ship to you in about a week you can i'm sure you can get the full chinese shipped from china for like ten dollars but it'll take like three months for them to get here so not having the room and everything else i decided i just want to go with a electronic flasher because it was way cheaper this electronic flasher is twelve dollars compared to two I need two sets because I have four just the same thing in the cat eye if you was to wire up a cat eye I gotta have two sets that's forty dollars compared to this twelve now on the cat eyes that's what I'm gonna end with the LED flasher relay heavy duty flasher at least for the 2500s are about eighty dollars I believe the 1500s take the EP29, which I did not mention. I don't know if the camera focuses in on it, but OBS Chevys do take an EP29 that you can get at your local AutoZone, O'Reilly's, Advance, anything like that. So, hope this guys, hope this helped, this video helped y'all. Yeah, I'm doing great, and some other words then. But I hope this video helped y'all. I want to say thanks for all the support and all the love. We're getting oh so close to 100 subscribers. And I cannot wait till we get there. So y'all just keep doing what y'all do. Comment. And I love the comments. I try to reply to all of them as soon as I see them. But with that, guys, this is another set of Flying H TV. And I'm out of here.